All right, I'm at Locust Lake Park today. I was somewhere earlier. I just I had just been up to the top of a uh, highest point in Schuylkill County, but got to combine trips, save gas money. So I'm about, I think I'm right here, and I'm gonna, there's a trail that goes around the lake, and then there's something called the uh, Oak Loop Trail I'm gonna take. I guess it's about four miles, so it's gonna be an extra couple hours of hiking. So, yeah. Um, as always, I bring it with me. So, it looks like there's too many people here, so. Um, this is in northern Schuylkill County, uh, near Tuscarora State Park, too. So, all right, so let's, let's head out. Well, here's a view of the lake. And where I'm hiking it, I think, is up Nose Hills up there. So, all right, pretty nice place. A, this is a Tuesday. It's just after Fourth of July weekend, so not a whole lot of people here. Probably was over the weekend, though. Yeah, so here's a map of Schuylkill County, and we are right here on this lake. So I guess I'm what's on what's called the bicycle path that goes around the lake. There's not a whole lot of signs around here that tell you where things are. So, if I'm going in a general direction, I need to go. This just took me out to this pier, which is still pretty cool. I need to be up there, so a little chipmunk showing me the way. Oops, there he goes. Well, pretty sure I found the trailhead here. Just come off this bicycle path around the lake, and it looks like we head this way the Oak Loop Trail. It's a nice. Nice little stream here. I think this is Locust Creek. Okay, here are some cool mushrooms. Uh, these are called uh, yellow patches, I believe. This one's broken off. Well, these don't have a lot of patches on top of them. They're members of the Amanita family. You can see the the ring, the bulb. Of course. Their cousin is the uh, destroying angel, which like, you know, kills people in like 16 hours. So, but these, you know, they usually have uh, like white patches on the top too, but these don't. So that's yellow patches. This is also a tree discovery trail. Trail. It was someone's a uh, scout project, Eagle Scout project. But a uh, label. Some of the trees are here. Some of the service berry. So randomly on the trail here, there's little signs here that tell you what the trees are. There are uh, campsites up there in the woods. And I can smell their campfire smoke. Just brings back memories. When I was little, I used to camp with my uncle. You know, the smells of the forest along with the campfire. It's always cool. All right, just off trail here, there's some neat things. I haven't seen these yet this summer. These are Indian pipe flowers. They actually have no photosynthesis, so they're not green. They're all over the place here. There's some over here too. I think you can see them all around back in there. So that's what these are, Indian pipes. They're pretty cool. This is a neat little trail. It's rather humid today, but I said it was supposed to be 88 degrees, but it's it's not 88 degrees. It's more like in the 70s yet. So this is a nice place. Of course, I'm in a deep shade here too, so that helps. Uh, and it wouldn't be one of my hikes 
without these guys, here he is. Little red eft. Well, the trail has left that little creek and we're just heading on a steeper uphill hike here. You can definitely feel the humidity now. All right, but I do know that since the trail's going up, it's gonna have to go back down. So that's a good, it's good to think, to think of. Here are some more of those Indian pipes just right along the trail. Well, whatever the name of this mountain is here, I, I climbed it on this trail. Huh. So, think of a flat section and then downhill. The second mountain I climbed today, the other one was not here. Like I said, I was at the Berks County, oh, not Berks County, uh, Schuylkill County high point. Because that mountain was a little easier to climb because it basically drove most of the way to the top. All right. To keep going here. So here's a here's a little American chestnut. You've seen in some of my other videos I've found these out here. So they are they are out here, like I say. This is just a little one. Yeah here's the here's the older here's the older stem. So there was a slightly larger tree that you know the blight killed and now Grown up from the roots. And here's another little red eft. Doesn't want to be photographed. Well, back down to walking along this nice stream. That was a bit of a strenuous hike up that mountain. I wasn't quite expecting that much, but I still enjoyed it. Feels a lot feels a lot cooler down here. It was definitely hotter up on the mountain. So back down this nice shady area. Here's a slightly better example of one of those yellow patches mushrooms. You can see the the white patches on the side there. Lots of times they cover the whole top, but and right here is where the stream flows into the lake because they have a nice beach area up there but I'm going to sit here and eat lunch somewhere right around here getting a bit hungry peanut butter and honey sandwich on marbled rye bread pretty good sorry, talk with my mouth full That's somebody else's Looking for lunch too. Oops. He's coming right up to me. It looks like he wants something. I lost him. There he is. Is he gonna go get it? Smell it? Smell it? Oh, you got it. Yeah, that's what he wanted. Yeah, there he is, still st stuffing his face. Yum, yum, yum. So I'm back on that bicycle trail back to the back to the truck. Um, but like I said, this is Locust Lake State Park. Pretty cool place. Um, it's on the smaller side when it comes to state parks, but uh, anyway, that trail was on. The brochure says like four miles, but I don't know, all in all, it took me about two hours to do this whole thing and eat lunch. So maybe it might have been less than four miles, but anyway. 
Anyway, thanks for coming along, and uh, I'll see you next time. Who knows where that will be? I often don't know where I'm going to go next, anyway. All right, so I'll see you.